One of the fundamental tenets of socialism is that the citizens must be disarmed. It's what happens in every nation that takes on this oppressive form of rule. It is no coincidence, as the calls for socialism in America come into the mainstream, so does the calls for the repeal of the Second Amendment. A recent Gallup poll shows that four in 10 Americans think socialism would be a good thing for America. Four in 10. What is most frightening to me is that many Americans can be duped into believing socialism is a good thing. That giving up your rights, including rights to defend yourself, is somehow in your best interest. It is not. Government, even our government, which is still the best in the world, manages to screw everything up. Bureaucracy is a disease inside not just our nation's capital, but every state house and city hall across America. Our government fails at nearly everything it does. And the few things it does well, well, it's wildly inefficient and wasteful. And yes, that goes for the military too. So as the left seeks to take away your guns and tell you it can protect you and tell you it can run your business better than you can, I urge you not to fall victim to liberal zombieism. Socialism is for lazy people. We as Americans are not lazy. It can be work to go to the range and train, but I do it because I know government will not be there for me when I need protection from evil. Because with a socialist government, the evil takes hold from within the government. Just look at Venezuela. So four out of 10 Americans think socialism is good. That means four out of 10 Americans are lazy and sick, blind, liberal zombies. Sick. It's an epidemic that must be stopped.